Dinosaurs Love Underpants, written by Claire Friedman and Ben Court. Welcome to Storytime with Miss Suzanne. Let's start a reading adventure together. Dinosaurs Love Underpants by Claire Friedman and illustrated by Ben Court. I have never seen a dinosaur in underpants. Have you? No? Let's see how they look. We see the T-Rex right there. And this book was written for Pantastic Gabriel. I guess he likes underpants. <gasps> look at all the underpants. Oh my, there's so many. <gasps> wow. I like the stars and the colorful polka dots. Which ones do you guys like? Oh yeah? That's a pretty cool one too. All right, the dinosaurs were all wiped out a long way back in history. No one quite knows how or why, but now this book solves the mystery. That's what we can see when we go to the museum. We see their bones. And those are the things that archeologists have found in the ground. So this is way, way back. It all began when cavemen, those are the hairy guys, felt embarrassed in the nude. That means naked. So someone dreamed up underpants to stop them from looking crude. They didn't like how they looked without their underpants. The dinosaurs roamed everywhere, all teeth and huge long necks. But the scariest and meanest was Tyrannosaurus Rex with his little tiny arms. That's a lot of dinosaurs. When T-Rex saw man's undies, he roared with deafening rant. I don't want to eat you up. I want your underpants. Oh, maybe because there's something new. That's why he's so interested in the underpants. The T-Rex stole a furry pair, but his briefs were quickly ripped. He couldn't get them past his feet. Oh, whoops, watch out, he tripped. Kerpush. That would probably rumble all through the ground. Triceratops was happy, wearing undies on every horn, top, top, and bottom, <gasps> till Strachosaurus snatched them, and they ended up all torn. Oh, no, I see the polka dot ones ripped on the ground, and the other ones are, oh, no, they're not being very nice. The pants from woolly mammoth coats made Stegosaurus itchy. Oh, they do look very prickly. Diplodocus was really mad. His briefs were way too pinchy. Oh, look, they're very tight. Ooh, that's not comfy, is it, my friends? We're running low on underpants, the quavemen caked, quaked in shock. These dinos are undie crazy. They've completely run amok. Oh, no, some of them don't have any undies on anymore because the dinosaurs stole them all. I wonder what they're going to do. Soon undies were flying everywhere, all torn by tooth and claw. The dinosaurs were fighting in a great brief's tug of war. What? Look at that. They're not saying, oh, look, your undies look cool. Oh, I like yours. They're ripping them off each other. They all look so angry and they're fighting. I'm telling you, nobody told dinosaurs to use their words, I guess. The mighty underpants war raged all night. Thump, pow, bash, thwack, clout. The fighting got so crazy, all the dinosaurs were wiped out. What did they mean? Wiped out. Really? Oh, the next day out crept the cavemen and cheered at what they saw. Hooray, our biggest enemy is now at last no more. Because they, oh. They got so hurt fighting. So when you put your undies on, always treat them with great care. Don't forget brief saved mankind. They're not just underwear. Hey, look, that kitty looks like one of the other kitties. And dinosaurs. And I have a dinosaur in my house who's making noise at the door. <gasps> look at those undies. Thank you for joining me, my friends. Have a great day. I'll see you next time.